All right, boys, we got the deck list here for you. It is the Serena V expanded list coming at you, updated for Fusion Strike. And this thing, as you can see, there's a lot of cards in here, a lot more than you're used to seeing from lists from me. Uh, shout out to Purple Tina, uh, one of the loyal followers of the channel. Uh, they gave this me this list to check out, and I'm absolutely loving it. So we're going to get into it here. Uh, first things first, for those who just want to copy paste it, there you go. And all right, for the rest of you who want to hear what I think, you're going to get it after the beat drop. Mm, there it is, boys. All right, we got ourselves the star hitter of the show here. Got the three Serena Vs with the Queen's Order. Discard as many of your bench Pokemon as you want. Attack does 40 more for each bench Pokemon you discard this way. This has a lot of potential, especially in Expanded, where you got access to Sky Field, allowing you to have up to eight benched Pokemon. So that maxes out at uh, 340 damage if you discard everything, if I recall. Nope. Which means that adding in the Muscle Band gets you up to 360, which pretty much one-shots everything you need it to one-shot. But just in case you can't for whatever reason, we also have a couple other hitters to help you. We got ourselves the Mars Shadow GX, which helps you hit that dark weakness, which is really important in the uh, expanded meta. You also got Mew for the psychic weakness, another really important weakness in the game. Uh, we also have ourselves, just in case you actually can't hit uh, everything uh, for one shot, you leave something on, let's say, oh, I don't know, two... Uh, 2 HP. Oh, we also have access to Metacham V with the Yoga Loop, being able to put two damage counters on a Pokemon and take an extra turn, which could be game-breaking if you're able to pull off that combo. As you can see, there are a lot of Pokemon in here because you need a lot of discard fodder, which is what you have the Giratinas here for. We play four of these with the Distortion Door. But you can afford to play a lot of support mons because you can just discard them with Serena as you use them. While we play that Dragonite EX with the pull-up, being able to put two basic Pokemon back in our deck or back in our hand, it's basically another um, it's basically another uh, rescue stretcher, but it's better uh, than having to do the one rescue stretcher, but you know, you get two things back and you get everything back in the deck uh, because, you know, oh, except EX, six, except Dragonite EX, you know, so all good there. We also got this Absol from uh, Evolve, uh, not Evolving Skies, Roaring Skies, I believe that set is. Uh, so when you play this Pokemon, you move three damage counters from one Pokemon to another, which can just help you with math, or you can get things off, you can get damage counters off of an active Pokemon that you've already pinged onto a bench Pokemon knowing you're already going to one-shot anyway, or you can set up Yoga Loop with it. Very good stuff. Uh, we also got that Pseudo Wudo with the Roadblock. Very good against the Dark matchup or other Skyfield users. It also makes it so your opponent can't utilize your Skyfield against you. Uh, we also got the one Crobat and one Dedene help us draw cards. One Tapu Koko to help us accelerate energy to potentially get that turn one Zarina attack. We got the one Oracorio GX to help us draw after we get knocked out, which is going to actually happen a lot more than you'd think. One Tapu Lele to help us search out our supporters, as well as Goss to help you finish off uh, people as well. Um, with the supporter back from the discard pile. And lastly, we also play one Execute Propagation, being able to put it from your discard pile into your hand, play it on your bench, or use it for Ultra Ball or Quick Ball Fodder is a very good card here indeed. Whew. A lot of time spent on the Pokemon there, but let's move on to the trainers here. We got ourselves a four battle compressors, put the stuff in the discard pile as needed. Got the Ace spec of choice, Computer Search, um, which... If you can't afford, Dowser Machine's just as good. Being able to get that fifth Sky Field or the second Field Blower would be really nice using Dowser Machine. Scoop Up Cyclone, another good option in this deck as well. Um, being able to scoop up your Dedenes or Crobats or uh, Absol, whatever, uh, Dragonite, uh, Eldegoss to then reuse is a very good strat. We also got ourselves that one escape rope to help us switch out of situations we're not like. And also, uh, you can 
uh, switch in your opponent's stuff if, let's say, they only have one or two things that they don't want to switch in. Uh, you can escape rope them. Very good card. One field blower, a little bit light. I would prefer two, but uh, I couldn't quite find room in this list for a second field blower because Chaos Swell does hurt this deck significantly. Um, so if you could find a way to fit in a second field blower, I would recommend it. Possibly in the place of escape rope. Um, if you're not really huge on escape rope here. We also got four quick balls, four ultra balls to help us search out all of our Pokemon. We have a lot of them, so you're going to need it. Two rescue stretchers as well, getting our stuff back, as well as, of course, it comboing with the battle compressor. Battle compressor into rescue stretcher, a very classic combo you've seen on this channel before. We've got ourselves a three rescue, or not rescue stretchers, uh, three versus seekers. Help you put supporters back into your hand. A very good card staple the aforementioned sky field which is the crux of this deck you have to have this out otherwise you're probably going to have a bad time we got ourselves the one coal res because your bench size is going to be pretty big you're going to be able to plus a lot off of coal res here we got ourselves that one guzma one end to help shuffle in your opponent's stuff and you know if they get ahead on you you can end them down to one and apply a lot of pressure and hopefully win the game that way one professor juniper help you draw cards and also, in my opinion, the best card in the deck here is that Rayhan. Being able to basically go from no Zarina to a full Zarina in one turn and search out your uh, Skyfield if it gets knocked or search out whatever other card you need, maybe a Verse Seeker to keep the Rayhan train going, knowing you're playing against a deck that can one-shot you back is so, so massive in my opinion. So I think Rayhan is another one of those cards that if you find a st something in here you don't like and you can cut, I'd recommend maybe adding a second Rayhan. He is that good for this deck. As for tools of choice, we got ourselves a two float stones, one muscle band, and round out the list, five grass energies, and three lightning energies. Whew. All right. That was a lot of stuff to go over. Uh, probably the longest deck profile I have done. But anyway, boys, let me know what you thought of this list down in the comment section below. Honestly, I'm loving it. Um, but anyway, we're going to move on to the gameplay now. We're playing against a weakness matchup in Volcarona. So you're going to see how we were able to deal with that matchup. Here it is. Oh, wait. Did you fucking... Oh, wait. <laughs> wait, did you ID yourself out of cut? Oh my god, is it a top 8 cut? Yo, Sinvas. No, you didn't just do that. Sinvas, you didn't just ID yourself out of cut, did you? Oh my god, Sinvas, you're actually a moron. <laughs> you are actually kind of a moron. Oh, <laughs> uh, <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> ah, uh, oh, I shouldn't be laughing that hard at you, but I'm going to anyway because I'm a bad person. <laughs> Oh. <laughs> uh. 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 All right. I'm good. Oh, I got Mulligan too. Fuck yeah. All right. We're playing against Volcarona. Oof. End to one for game. Ba barely made it at number eight. Hey, they just need the streamer, right? They needed the streamer in the game, right? That's that's all it is. Kappa, right? Uh. How do you... Oh, that's so sad. That's literally the... Uh, the, the fucking... Uh... What's that? What's that Twitter meme? Not the Twitter meme. It's the TikTok meme. It's like, I'm so happy. I'm so sad. That's literally you uh, right now. <laughs> uh, all right. Give me fucking... Oh, this is not in there, boys. No... Uh... Uh, do I have the other thing? Do I have this thing? I do. Hell yeah.
You keep getting bad hands with Galarian Moltres. Yeah, dude, there's sometimes it's just one of those things, right? Where you get, you know, it's just one, sometimes one of those decks kind of thing where the deck works for everyone else and doesn't work for you. That's a very common uh, symptom of this game sometimes. It's one of those things we call shit happens. And uh, it's just one of those. Uh... Where you go, yep, Satch. We're gonna do that. And we're gonna pass it back. Now, the thing is that this deck, this Volcarona deck, generally will not be able to Guzma and also get their attack off turn one. Um, however, if they do, we fucking lose this game. Oh, uh, Basculin in the chat, though, boys. If you want an exclamation mark pokey catch, if you want that. All right, so they go for the battle compressor here. Shoot, did I? Uh, I didn't. Uh, I didn't grab a didn't grab a supporter with my discards. So that was somewhat suboptimal, but it's okay. They should be able to take a knockout here on Giratina at some point. Um, you'll send it to me in Discord and see if I can try to fix it if possible. <laughs> I might be the wrong person to ask about that type of deck, dude. I am not big brain enough to play that, but I will try anyway, just for you. All right, go surging flames for the 160 and the knockout. But didn't really get enough uh, other any other things really uh, set up that well. Um, and now we might be running into an issue here because we didn't get the two energies accelerated onto Serena. Um, we might be in a bit of trouble here, but that's okay. Uh, we're going to play that. Get the muscle band as well. Uh, Sudowoodo down. And then we can go distortion door, distortion door. And then I think, uh, discard oops all my cards is enough for knockout. <coughs> is it? 40. Oh, I can draw with this too. I definitely should have done that beforehand. I really forgot about that. That might be a misplay. Mm, no, it's no punish, possibly. Because we just drew into Juniper, boys. Let's get rid of... Let's use Field Blower. Get rid of that. So you can hinder his draw a little bit. And then we can use Juniper to draw some cards. Sent it. All right, seen it, dude. Oh, uh, well, we do have research, or we have computer search, so we can guarantee the knockout here. So let's do that. Let's go, let's go search, get rid of a quick ball and a quick ball, or no, we'll get rid of the two ultras. That hurts, but we'll do it anyway, Um, because I do want to keep the quick, but we do need to get a sky field. I also want to keep the Rayhan um, because that's our only other way of accelerating energy here. So, um, yeah, we might need that pretty badly, huh? Or I might just keep the Verse Seeker and discard the Rayhan. I think we're going to do it that way, actually. Um, and we can go for another Serena. Then we can double Distortion Door, and then we'll have enough juice for the knockout here. So we got the hand attached. We got the Rayhan for next turn to search our Skyfield just in case they uh, cuck us out of it. Um, so that's 40, 80, 120, 160, 180, 200. We need one more after that. So I think we get rid of the Sudowoodo too, right? this point yeah i think we get rid of pseudo widow yeah all right we're good one and another prize oh execute that's a decent little prize there boys all right uh and when they go for the knockout here we'll be able to go uh verse seeker rayhan and then we'll also search it depends on what he does here if they're able to get a uh, if they're able to get a stadium here, then uh, we'll obviously have to grab the stadium 
to counter it. Um, otherwise, we're going to go for a draw, like a draw supporter for the next turn. I think. Uh, probably no, we'd probably just go for another Verse Seeker and then we can Rayhan next turn. And then our quick ball would be for Serena. I think that's I think that's it. Right? Yeah, sounds about right. Alright, so now they're gonna strike us with the surging flames. Too hot. They're gonna do enough for the weakness, but it probably doesn't matter at this point. I don't have enough prizes on board for them to uh really threaten me here. I also have Oracorio to draw cards too, so I mean, you know, that's a thing. Um yeah, okay, we'll do that first. I, oh, and we got Rescue Stretcher. So, Rescue Stretcher here, really, really nice. Um, so, we can put the Zarina back in our hand. Uh, then we can go Rayhan. So, we can go Energy on to that search for a verse seeker which we don't have that is really unfortunate boys yeah that's super duper unfortunate oh i guess we can go eldegoss yeah, we'll search for goss then uh sure Distortion door, distortion door, distortion door. One. Two. I know I still can draw cards, too. Uh, so we're going to do that. Three. Four. One, two, three, four. Who's that person knocking at my door? <clears throat> all right so how many do we need damage we need 40 so we already had 40 on so we need 170 so it's 40 80 120 160 so it is actually just these four that we need that's pretty cool um all right let's actually go like this let's go Get rid of these because I don't need them. Maybe just add another thing to the bench here. Yeah, and then we just have to discard this too. Right? That sounds about right. One, two, three, four, five. Five times four is 200, plus that is 220, which is enough for the knockout. Let me take two prizes here, and there should be very little counterplay for my opponent here. Scorched Earth does come down for my opponent, um, but that's okay. Um, we still have the Goss in hand. Yeah, this deck's super duper good. I like it. And because I searched the Goss with the computer search, he doesn't know what it is. So... That's the uh, big brain part of the play here. Is that by not knowing what exactly the card is, uh, he, he can't, like... I mean, it's not like this deck does have any shuffles, but if he hypothetically did, it makes the decision to force a shuffle a little bit tougher. I mean, N is like that, you know, you'll end, end me down to two out of a five-card hand seems like a decent decision, but... You also get to counter end with Oracorio because Oracorio just lets you draw cards and it's pretty nice. So you even if you get end to two, you drop to five. Still solid. All right. Oracorio here, and we pretty much win the game at this point. Uh, 
yeah, we go Goss for the Rayhan. And then it's Rayhan. Serena. Search Stadium. Stadium. Hand attach. All the Giratinas, boys. Hey, man, just know you see all these Giratinas in your front yard. Just know that upstairs I'm going hard. Bing bong. Easy. Easy. There it is, boys. <laughs> Too damn good. All right, boys, that's going to do it for today. If you enjoyed it, hit the like button, subscribe to the channel. If you want to see me live, you can catch me over on Twitch. Link in the description down below. But until the next time, I'm Derek for Table 500, and I will see you in the next one. Peace.